All men dream, but not equally. Those who dream by night, in the dusty recesses of their minds, wake in the day to find that it was vanity. But the dreamers of the day are dangerous men, for they may act their dream with open eyes to make it possible. This. I did. Hands up. Enjoying yourself, pal? Oh, yeah, you're a comedian. Nice warm welcome. They're both clean. My apologies. One can't be too careful. I'm guessing you're Talbot? Mr. Sullivan. And Mr. Drake. That's right. Do you have it? Let's, uh... See the money first. Cut out. It's all there. Now let's see it. I'll need to authenticate it. Of course. Silver. 16th century, Elizabethan design, inscribed with Sir Francis Drake's motto. Well, it appears to be genuine. Well, of course it's genuine. If I may ask, how did you two come into this? Does it matter? <laughs> My client will be very pleased. Hold on a minute. Sully, this is fake. I assure you, Mr. Drake. Oh, oh, you are right. This is phony as a $3 bill. What the hell are you trying to pull here? Perhaps I should be asking you. This is bullshit. Deal's off, pal. And you? You can tell your client. You blew it. Come on, Nate, let's get the hell out of here. You're not really in a position to negotiate. Now give me the ring, take the case, and walk out of here like gentlemen while you still can. Do as the man says, son. You're a thief. Well now, that's ironic. Right. 
No time to rest. All right, mate. You're done for. Second there, mate. I'll be right with you. Okay, ready for more. Gonna need a plunger. Come on. Let's go, Nate. Here. You can get out the back. You look like shit. Ugh. And smell like it. Stop him! I've got the old geezer! <laughs> <laughs> you might with your protege, I see. Not very dignified for a man of your age. Should have known you'd be behind this. 
Well, careful now. Wouldn't want you to melt. <laughs> Same cocky little shit. So fearless. I wonder what you're really afraid of. Not bullets or blood or broken bones. No. You get off on all this, don't you? Cheating death. Or not. No. <laughs> Mr. Sullivan, I won't harm your precious boy. I merely want what's mine. Give me that back. Cut her! Oh no. Oh. Shut, Shut up. up! You fool! Oh, you're bloody welcome, Your Majesty. Marlow, we have to get you out of here. Oh, come on, they're a right pair of arseholes. What? 